chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know already, my name is Alicia, and if you have not subscribed already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So, I'm not sure what day is this going to be on, but as you guys know, I am participating in Vlogmas. So, <clears throat> well, my Vlogmas is a little different because I'll be doing, I guess, regular content videos. Hold on, let me catch my breath. Hmm. <laughs> but seriously, um, I'll be doing a regular content video. Um, for the most part, I think I have scheduled a couple of vlogs in here but we will see how it goes um so this video is gonna be an empties video i know back in my day when i first started youtube a lot of people used to do empties and empties is really good because it's like a little review of everything all in one so i need to get this bag out of my room and it's overflowing a little bit. It's just a little Marshall bag. Um, but I need to get it out of my room and throw it away. So, because I do not like clutter. I think I talk about this every video. <laughs> but let's get to the video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And join me for the rest of Vlogmas. Um, so, here's the bag. Is a component of everything. We have some feminine products we have some hair products we have some body products but let's get into it so for the first video is um always pure pads free of hypoallergenic cotton top layer free of dye and fragrance um this and it looks like this this is the closest thing i can get to the honest because um i don't have a target like nearby nearby um so i saw this at my walmart and i got it i know somebody said they have they have them at walmart but i haven't seen them so yeah um i actually feel like i noticed a difference in these like my cycle is a lot shorter um almost yeah it's a lot shorter um and I, I just feel a difference like you know you know your girl so you could feel the difference um, and I suggest anyone I'm kind of leaning more over to the natural products of things I naturally uh, I start wearing a more natural deodorant I have the armor hammer deodorant I haven't got native yet but I have my armor hammer deodorant and I'm trying to move on over to the more natural things of more natural things how many times I'm gonna say that <laughs> so that's that and I stopped using equal styler so I end up getting wet line extreme wet line extreme and I've used all of it um what my goal is to do well not gonna lay my hair down first of all so um I might end up trying something else or the blue version because this is says it's the um, extra firm hold 24 hours, not my hair. Um, my hair been going through some things, I guess, since it been going through some things. So maybe we're going to learn some things off my hair, I mean, from my hair from this series, but we'll see. But yeah, the Wet Lime Extreme, everyone waves about it. Um, it works pretty good on my sister's hair and stuff when I do her hair, but... I'm still trying to figure out my hair all over again. It and then it says it's aloe vera gel, no residue, alcohol free, and with UV filters. So that's good. That's a plus. Let me see. I think I got a couple of these in here. So this is the um, Tree Hub Shea Sugar Scrub and Coconut Lime, and this is in Sh Shea Sugar Scrub. So these are the two. I have, wait, this is made with um, shea, shea butter, <laughs> pineapples, and coconut. Um, I think this is the most recent one I used up right here. Um, but I go through these. I exfoliate my body often. Uh, maybe two times, three times a week. But I also use these on my, is the feet pedicure? Yeah, the pedicure. I also use these on my pedicure. So I go through these a ton. I go through them and these are the only ones I saved but yeah go through them and this is the um Ole 
uh, women multivitamin. Um, this was really good. Like, I, I think you're supposed to take two a day or something like that. And I went through these. It's a powerful blend with vitamins A, C, D, E, B, biotin, and folic acid. Um, to be honest, I'm not sure if I've seen a difference in anything, but it did taste good. My camera's about to die. So if it dies, I do have a backup. Um, here's the Dove um, Carrion Body with Shea Butter and Warm Vanilla. Really good. I love, love, love this. And it actually lasts a long time. I take about two, two showers a day and it lasts a long time. This is uh, both. Um, as you guys know, I've been saying I'm trying to figure out my hair all over again. I remember in the beginning of my, um, what is that called? Natural hair journey. I was using these products. And I used these as a leave-in, a deep conditioner. Everything. I'm sorry, I thought I hurt my kid. Um, but I really like this. And I definitely recommend this to anyone, anyone in the natural hair community. Um... Okay, so I'm not sure where I left off at, but I I know for sure I was talking about these. These are the Aussie Moist. Um, this is the conditioner. This is the Three Miracle Conditioner. It does keep your hair very moisturized. I know that for sure for these. And um, I like it. I do twist outs. Yeah, I do twist outs with these, this. And I actually do it as a leave-in conditioner. Um, and I like it. Okay, so I have a love hate with Got to Be. Um, got to Be in the black bottle. Um, for a while, this was working for my hair to keep him, my edges tame. Hold on. So, yeah, this was working to keep my edges tame, but now it just like, I don't know, I don't know, nothing's working on my hair. So, um, I will try to do the tests for the hair porosity and then I'll move forward from there to see like how to figure out my hair or whatever the case may be. But I did use it all because I'm not wasting any money over here. And this is the Mio Organics uh, Flexible Hole Edge Gel. When I first used it, I was like, okay, but then I had it for a long time and I ended up leaving the top open but I did try to use as much as I can um, and when I was doing I think I did passion twist with it but other than that this is garbage and I don't I would for my hair because once again I am trying to relearn my hair um, so I would not get this again because I know for sure it didn't work but um, I have not seen good things about Miel, the, the CEO, and her husband. So I want to refrain from saying I will not purchase again. But um, I have other brands that I really like a, lo a lot better and actually works for me. Speaking of which, it's the TGIN. Um, these products really work for me. Um, this is the... Uh, sweet honey hair milk with the raw honey um, agave nectar it is a I guess a moisturizer and I used this uh, I I didn't even I didn't want it to be done <laughs> it was nine dollars at Marshall's I get a lot of their products at Marshall's um, and I have not had an issue with any other products I use from them um, so that's definitely gonna be my go-to and this is the edge control it works for a second for me, but again, I said I can't find anything to really lay my edges. Um, besides, this kiss what I got going on right now, and that's only because I just been in the house. I have not, I have not been outside, so we don't know. And so, but I will continue to purchase this if I have to because I would use it on my son's hair or my hair when I'm doing his braids. Um, yeah, so this is a really good for the braids. Like, you know, people use jam. This could be good too. Okay, the bum bum. My is this the one my sister gave me? Yeah, this is the one my sister, sister gave me for um, 
I'm sorry, I keep hearing things, um, for a Christmas gift. Um, I have the green one still, but I use this all up, like, all up. You don't see anything in there. Um, and I kept my body pretty soft, and that's, that's what I look for. I like to feel very soft, like, you know, you know, you know, if you know, you know. <laughs> okay, let's talk about this. Let me see. This is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Pro versions. I think they came as a set. Um, I honestly wouldn't waste my money on getting it again because I have, okay, so this could be a video too. Like, the products I wouldn't recommend you waste your money on, such as mascara. <laughs> I have this bomb, bomb mascara that I just truly love, like, I put in my kit and everything. Love it. And the care 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 stick, definitely a steal, definitely a buy. Especially when you wear your hair straightened and you want to lay your flyaways. This is it. Or it's another stick, but this is a little expensive. It's another stick that's cheaper. And I let me see if I can find it. The Lush um, slick, slick Stick. I would recommend this, but if you want to spend a little bit more money, get this. But they work the same. And this is Suave um, Shampoo. This is a good affordable shampoo. Um, it lathers up pretty good and it cleans your hair really good. I rarely use shampoo. That's why you don't see much in here. I rarely use it because um, I may wash my hair like once a month. Um, but yeah. This is a really good inexpensive shampoo. Okay, we're getting down to the end. We have two more products left. Um, this is the Shrip Last Adhesive. I'm not sure what's the brand. I think this is Kiss. Just a second. Okay, yes, it's Kiss. Okay, yeah. It is. All over the place. That's why this is kind of like a vlog video. <laughs> but this is the kids' uh, last trip. Um, what do I want to say about it? I do like this. That's what I can do. I like this brush on here. Way better than the brush on um, the current lash glue I'm using. But this is really good. Honestly, because I had bought another one. It's really good. Like, I really like it. I'm going to definitely use the tip of that. And this, you guys. I have got... This is the first lip gloss I ever used up. And I was actually scraping corners. Like, look. Scraping corners. So... You know it was a good lip gloss when you were scra scraping corners. And I actually treated myself the other day. I brought some things back to Ulta and I got the cookie. Um, too Much Mouth, I forgot her real name, but Too Much Mouth on here, rave about cookie. So I got that in Glaze. I love Glaze and I got one to put in my makeup kit because I got several backups for myself. Um, excuse me but what I learned to do is not to try to overextend myself in the makeup area um just get what I need and that's in any of these departments when I use something up I don't have tons of backup anymore because I used to be like oh let me get it before it runs out but I, I'm doing better with that I'm trying not to be like a hoarder or anything um when it comes to that so yeah that concludes this video i hope you guys like it um and if you guys want to see more empties video let me know um i haven't stacked up anything else this was what i currently have in this bag and i'm so glad i'm done with it because i want to go ahead and toss this stuff um and yeah let me know if you guys want to see more of these kind of videos um did i miss anything 
I hope I didn't miss anything. Now, if you guys want to see how I got my hair just like this, with the Navi, just like this, just like these, <laughs> just like this with the Navi's, the clip-ins, let me know as well. Um, uh, not let me know because I already did a video that will be part of this vlogmas. I don't know which video is going up before one another, but I will try to link it in the cards um, or link it and link it below. But yeah, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later. Mwah, mwah, mwah.